Okay, my base is slowly going to be draining itself of power through that scanner room. Uh, I got stuff to make it keep running. 400 power. Hi, thank you for the bright flash of light. Um, hi. My PDA wanted me to get a pet, didn't it? I now have a pet. Can I name you? <laughs> what are you doing in here? Well, thank God it's not a stalker, but... I have a rabbit ray pet. I have a rabbit ray pet. I'm loving it. It's not supposed to happen like this, but it happened. Fine by me. Okay, um... Scanner room. If I switch you off, stop scanning, what happens? They disappear completely. Okay. And if I then go back to scanning, like... Go back to scanning limestone. Okay. Do you just... Okay, it slowly starts over again. So if I stop scanning, all the data disappears. So I have to keep the scanner room running all the time if I want to make the most use of it. Well, okay then. In any case, uh, quickly gonna store... All these new resources. This is just absolutely perfect. So much stuff. I'm loving it. Okay. Um, you were ready with more stuff, I think. Working with salt. Water is completely full. So let's take that. Uh, you're getting pretty full. This reclaimed water. It's actually... Uh, I'm not sure. Should I keep on using it? Maybe. I have so much disinfected water. It, uh, I have too much stuff. I have way too much stuff. I need all... I need lockers for my spare water and food. And I did never anticipate this would happen. I think in general I'm just... I'm running out of space. I'm gonna have to build more lockers. But where? Where am I going to build lockers and make things still look good? Okay, I got enough titanium for five lockers. Uh, maybe in here. Could I do that? It might not look the best, but it's... It's something, and it keeps... I just need more space. I have way too much water. Why am I having so much water? Like, my problem is not a shortage, but an overflow of water. Drinkable water. Oh my god. Okay, you to the side. Perfect. And then one more. There we go. Also, are you... Oh, you're on the front of the re uh, reinforcement, which makes you look bigger. I was wondering, what? why is it so cramped all of a sudden? Okay, all this reclaimed water is actually going... Uh, no reclaimed water here. It's going away. I have way too much water. I might actually have to remove the still suit. Just maybe. What do I... What do I need for the other suit? I had a reinforced suit. I have... I can move over to that at some point, but I need synthetic fibers, diamond, and titanium. What do I need for the synthetic fibers? Benzene and fiber mesh. What did I need for fiber mesh? Creepvine sample. Two creepvine makes one. I think I can do that. I think I'm capable of doing that. So, one, two, three... You're gone. Okay, uh, can I grab one of these, please? Come on. There we go. Place you back in here. Nice. Okay, now we can turn this into fiber mesh. We got the benzene down below. If I remember correctly. Batteries are fully charged. Great. Uh, fiber mesh. That's one. That's two. Uh... That was made in a modification station, wasn't it? 
I think it was reinforced. No, normal equipment. So th synthetic fibers requires two fiber mesh, two benzene, two synthetic fibers. No one. Diamond, titanium, diamond, titanium. I can do this. I can do this. Uh, diamond. Great. Titanium. Great. Uh, benzene. High grade. Craft thing over here. Benzene. I only need one of those. Oh, this should be it then, right? So, uh, synthetic fibers. Personal equipment. Two diamonds. I thought I had... I thought I picked up two. I didn't. Alright, here we go. Equipment, reinforced dive suit, heavy synthetic fiber dive suit providing physical protection and enhanced survival in extreme temperatures. If I'm gonna go deeper, I'm gonna encounter more of those geyser things, most likely. And that means I have a new set. Um, do I need radiation protection? I don't think I do. Which means reinforced gloves and... Reinforced dive suit means I lose out on the constant water gain, which maybe I'm looking at at the, the you know different way in a wrong way. Like it is useful. I'll be very honest with that. But right now it's just cluttering my inventory over and over. Um, how are you doing? Doing well enough. I have more salt, which means uh, I think I should. Turn some of these peepers uh, into other stuff. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's cook up some food, shall we? All right. Let's see how good this food is. The peeper is thirty-two and minus two. How much? Wow, that is nearly as good in the food department as those high-grade water bottles of a fluid. Now you just gotta make sure you bring the right amount with you for every trip. Forty f What? Over salty but very filling, dehydrating but keeps so forty-four from a cured Reginald. Um I no, wrong way. Wrong way. Losing my way in my base. Um Okay, all these peepers are gonna have to go. All of the peepers are gonna have to go. Uh, oh, no, that's a peeper. That's another peeper. How many peepers? So many peepers. So many Reginalds. Okay, I have several Oculus. How is the Oculus doing? Uh, one Oculus in the tank. Uh, No, there's two Oculus in here, and several Reginalds. Quite a lot of Reginalds, by the way. Let me see, is that Oculus of any value to me? Uh, no, I need salt, I need salt. I need more salt. Okay, let's see. Um, the Oculus is 11 food, minus 7 water, it's... Uh, okay, so it's worse than the people by the looks of things, but what if I cure it? Is that going to change anything? Meaty and still strong in flavor, dehydrating but keeps well. Um, dark, dense meat, a good meal. Are you of any use to me? A normal... 30 food, minus 2... I'm just better off eating the Reginalds. Definitely better off eating the Reginalds. Which means I'm actually going to remove the Oculus from the alien containment. No, wrong way. Again. <laughs> Bloody hell. Remove the Oculus from here. There we go. Oculus away. And you too. You didn't breed anymore. So only Reginalds remaining. Good. Then I have my steady supply of food over here that I can cure to get it with the salt. I don't have to worry or rely entirely 
on the nutrient blocks anymore. This works. Okay, cured beaver, cured, 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 oculus. Um, do I have more salt? I don't. Um, I think I'm gonna cure the Reginalds and the... The oculus wasn't as... Yeah, the beaver is just better than the oculus. Hmm, question. If I were to normally cook it, perhaps, does that change anything? Uh, cooked Oculus. And I'll also cook one normal Reginald. How does that work? Is that anything changing? Cooked Reginald plus four water. So in every single sense, the cooked Reginald is just better. Even better than the Peepers. So... Huh. Well, in that case, uh, let's put, uh, okay, let's remove two of those, uh, let's add the Reginald and let's add the Oculus. A little bit of a cute aquarium. And the rest of the fish is going, I'm gonna go away unless, yeah, I don't see the need to cook all these peepers up so fish sorry for capturing you be free be absolutely free okay i'm just really liking this so much you have more salt and more water oh perfect okay um Let's just stuff this in here. It's good enough. We got the fiber mesh remaining. So that is going to go with the high grade stuff for now. Uh, high grade. There we go. It's not really high grade, more medium or mid grade or something, but it works. Anyway, now that I have magnetite, can I make more? Uh, I got the scanner hut room chip. Don't need that. Don't need more camera drones. Do I need range up? Great. Maybe. One copper, one magnetite. If I go for more range, could it maybe find other stuff in that case? Uh, one copper, one magnetite. I have some magnetite to spare right about now. Uh, this thing has four upgrade slots. This is one upgrade in that case, right? There we go. Scanner room. Add this. Okay, what are the other things I can make? Uh, scanner room speed upgrade. Do I need speed? Don't think I do. Uh, copper magnetite. Copper magnetite. Um... I'll use two more. I'm not going to go all out with full upgrades, but this should be good enough. Three upgrades in total for, to increase the, the range. There we go. One more. And another one. Is this possibly going to be enough for the range? Oh, whoa. That just increased in size. Oh, my God. Okay, um... Can I look for... No. I can't, I can't, I... Okay, fine. Maybe one extra upgrade. It... Maybe this is a complete waste. But I know where to find stuff now. You, one more scanner room range upgrade. I don't need the other things. Here you go. Upgrade to the, nearly the side of the room. Oh my god. Okay. Um, yeah, you're not going to find anything, are you? No. Um, or do I? Huh. If I were to bring you to the south... This direction. Range upgrade. Does that mean I can bring you further than 300 meters before st ow, stuff gets fuzzy? Maybe. 
Or is it going to get fuzzy anyway? Who knows? Um, I think we're just going to see. I have two cameras in total. If I bring you as far as I possibly can. I'll be closer to the edge. Maybe that works. Uh, is it going to mess up? Yes, it's going to mess up. Uh, there's a stalker. Okay, can I... I'm not going to get close enough. I'm not going to get close enough. Or am I? Oh, vision is absolutely terrible. I'm near the cave. Okay. So, near 500 meters, it becomes absolutely terrible. Um, if I were to place you right over here. There we go. That means on my HUD... Um, let me see, let me see. Beacon manager. Um, drone 1. It's all the way over there. Does that mean you can now see magnetite? Chill out, crop, stalker tooth? No, nothing at all. Oh well. It was worth a shot. Definitely worth a shot. Okay, anything else? Upgrade? No. Okay, that means the scanner room is done usable in its entirety for me um i need water thank god for marble melons okay so where does that leave me i have magnetized what else did i wanted to make now that i have magnetite like uh modification station the lightweight high capacity tank, that is just a normal capacity tank, but it's lighter, allows for enhanced maneuverability. Don't think that's going to be too useful to me, like I have this massive H2O or uh, O2 tank right now. It's glorious, I like it. Um, Seamoth depth module MK2, I need plasteel ingots, magnetite and enameled glass. How do I make plasteel ingots? Plasteel requires titanium ingot and two lithium. Um, ten titanium, two lithium, which means in total I would need four lithium, twenty titanium. That's a lot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I might actually. Ooh. Can you look for... You can look for wrecks. Huh. Look for metal salvage, please. There should be a lot around. If I take that and turn it into titanium, I should have enough for those depth modules in a bit. You go over there. Perfect. All right. Let's see. Show me where the metal salvage is. Of course, I'm going to steal the metal salvage from my stalker friend like this. Maybe. But is he really using it right now? Like, dude, st still no teeth. Yeah, go play with this metal salvage. Can you play with this? Come on, I'll drop it on the, the ground. There you go. Two pieces. Play with that, please. Come on. And I'll take this one too. Okay, and the further I go, you have enough metal salvage to play around with. Um, I'll also take all of these. Do I have still... Still got room. Good, 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 good. I hope these stalkers don't mind me taking these. Just in case. Oh, God. Alright, that is a fair bit of metal salvage, which means I should have enough right now. Uh, let's hope I have enough of the other stuff too. Let's see, you turn all of this into titanium, please. Then we need two titanium ingots. One titanium ingot, come on. And number two. Okay, and did I need lithium? 
for the death modules in that case. What was it? What did I need? Uh, I need two magnetite and enameled glass, and I need no uh, plasteel ingots. What did I need for plasteel ingots? Those were the things I was trying to make. Four lithium in total. Let's see. Four lithium. One, two, three, four. Got a fair bit of that. Uh, scanner room is still searching. Not sure if I want to do that. Um, you, plastic ingots. All right. What else? What else? Uh, four. I got the plastic ingots, and then want the glass. I need stalker tooth and glass. And I needed the stalker stuff for uh, two magnetite enameled glass. Let's grab that magnetite uh, right over here. Two of them. And enameled glass. I have the gems and stuff over here. So two of those together with the stalker tooth. Also, that's going to mess me up a lot. Can I? If I would just... Unequip this. Okay, that is perfect. Okay, so if I want to get rid of all of this, I can easily do that. I'm most likely not going to get rid of it that quickly. Like, it, Sorry if it's going to bother people, but it might be helpful for me. Um, stalker teeth. I need one of them, I think. Let's see. Enameled glass requires glass and stalker too, so I got the right amount of quartz. There we go, enameled glass. And now for the third level, or the next one, I needed three rubies. Thank god that I picked up so many of them. Hi, Rabbit Ray, how are you doing? <laughs> uh, okay, gems, gems, gems. One, two, three. And now I think I have to do this at the modification station? Or... Seamoth upgrades. I need to remove it from this thing. Got it. Okay, access upgrades. Uh, you, an equip. Push up now 200 meters. Let's upgrade that, shall we? There you go. Not sure how much this is. Uh, yeah, enhances considerably. Does it matter? For me to know how much number two is, I don't think so. We're just going to go straight to number three. There we go. Now you, in here, 900 meters. Oh my god, that's perfect. Uh, we do have room for two more. Is there more upgrade stuff that we can make? It's only the depth upgrade, so... Uh. Not sure about that. Uh, air tank upgrades, don't need that. Don't need Cyclops, fin upgrades, ultra light fin. I think that's good. Uh, huh? I had stuff stored in here, didn't I? Yes, I had forgotten about this. Thank God there's a little bit more magnetite. Let's quickly deposit this. Alright, that is everything stored nicely. Uh, that does beg the question. I don't need to look for metal salvage. So if we stop scanning for you, there's really no upgrade or anything. I can look for stalker tooth. I'm curious. All these stalkers have been swimming around here all this time. Um, how much would I need to fully fill that locker? Not too many, I suppose. A fair bit. Stalker tooth. I might actually go for a little bit of stalker tooth hunting. I don't need it right now, but it might be nice to have in the nearby future. Thank God that you dropped some. Um, over here too. Now, am I going to find them in those areas too with the forest or... All the way over here? Yeah, I wonder if I'm going to find many more in these creepvine forests. Like, how long have these stalkers been playing around here? How hidden are these stalker teeth? Maybe a fair bit. Like, they're constantly playing around. 
Okay, more stalker tooth down there. Great. Yeah, this upgrade is going to make my life so much easier. This is glorious. Absolutely glorious. Um, I'm running around a little bit here. Left, right, left, right. Without any decent way of doing this properly. But, hey, it works. Alright, I think that's everything right now. The scanner room is not really picking up anything else. Um, which is curious. I'm okay, there's one more there. And one more there. Okay, there... How deep are those? Okay, I'm curious. Where the hell are they? Ooh, might that be... Um... Oh my god. How the hell do I get to that? Like, those stalkers are so deep on the ground. It's... Huh? Okay, where is that big freaking tube that I saw? The big coral tube. Not here. This is my way into the case, but not what I'm looking for. Uh, hi, how are you doing? Please blow yourself up. Thank you. Okay, you know where they are, but... In here. So there's a stalker in these caves somewhere all the way down below. Question is, how the hell did that stalker even get that deep? Even I don't know how to get there. Like, what kind of hole does that stalker go into to get all the way down the air? If only there was something like a pathfinder towards those things. Ooh, you look promising. Oh boy. Yeah, that looks like the right thing. Oh, uh, running out of oxygen. I'm forgetting about my need of oxygen. Uh, let's not blow up in my face. Oh, power. Great. I'm wasting battery. Yes. And still haven't found those two stalker teeth. Uh, I want to find them. And I'm going to find them. Um... How's my habitat builder doing? Habitat builder doesn't... It doesn't need a battery. Definitely does not. There we go. <laughs> oh my god. I want those talker teeth right now. I want to know where the hell they are. Even this is not going to bring me to them. What? How? How? Either they lie in some unexplored cave entrance, or they might have glitched through the seafloor. I mean, we've got a rabbit ray flying inside our base. Anything is possible. Okay, I must be missing something very obvious to get there. I... Uh... Okay, fine, I'll ignore those stalker teeth, unless there's a passage... On this side somewhere. Right now it's not a matter of I need those teeth. I just want to know how to get to them. I think I'll leave those alone. Yeah, there's no way for me to find those teeth wherever they went. For all I know they fell through the world floor and that's why I can't find them. Uh. Well, I'll just settle with the easy to get ones. Uh. What was that? Again, the noise. What is that? Ah, I don't know. Some of it is just environmental noise. Others is just ambience. It's, uh, I don't know. Okay. I think that should be enough for now. So let's go back to the base. And see what the next plan is. Like, 
What are we going to do after this? We can go 900 meters deep right now, but... What do I want to do next? Figuring out what to do next is going to be interesting for... Do we attempt to get the resource for the prawn suit? Or do we try to go to the depth of 900 meters? And... Where are all those alien sites?